Guys, I just I just seen a question come across come across my uh, notification. However, I, I think the individual erased it. I'm not sure. But guys, I'm telling y'all, man. You know, guys, last week I was trying to figure out how to turn off my comments to my YouTube because honestly, I don't I don't you guys know I don't do this for comments. If I did this for comments and views, guys, I would have quit YouTube a long time ago. I do this for anybody that understands what the hell is uh, going on with me, uh, who looking for basically the energy that I'm putting out is for the people who looking for me and what I'm saying and who resonate exactly with what I'm saying. The other ones who can't figure it out, that that's on them. That doesn't have nothing to do with me. Meanwhile, I get to dialogue all my you know experiences that I'm going through and in, in this life of mine that's like a movie so this individual know who they I'm not gonna mention the name but they asked me now that I just got to finish guys telling you guys I guess for the past three or four weeks about how America is China now and you know how everybody is job hopping you never see the same person at the job more than two or three weeks right I even mentioned how much uh, money that I make compared to the average worker, skilled labor. I mean, I believe I made a video about that uh, a few days ago. I told you that bartenders and gig workers are actually making more money than teachers and entry and, uh, and entry and a lot of entry level people. We're talking about people who, who get a bachelor's degree. And as far as y'all, and as far as owning your own business, well, this pandemic already proved to us that that's going to be a dead end too because they can if if the if the government can come in and shut down your business over any little thing any little thing and then keep walmart and and mcdowell's open what does that tell you about you having chances of, of opening a small business and being successful so this individual asked after after me explaining all that this is somebody i, I guess they not this is why i say y'all you can hear somebody but that that don't mean you listening you can look at something, but that don't mean you seeing. So I, after I just got through explaining that a grown man who hustles in Chicago on a gig app can make $7,000 a month before taxes, before gas. So that means technically what? He's really making about uh, $4,500 a month, right? Or $4,000 a month, right? If you want to take out those, those fees. Okay. So as we're talking almost fifty thousand dollars a year. And whether you're making fifty thousand dollars a year or a hundred thousand dollars a year or even a hundred and fifty thousand dollars a year, I believe, don't quote me, I believe you're under the same tax bracket. That means guess what? That means whether you're making fifty or a hundred and fifty, it don't fucking matter. You're in the same boat. Okay, so maybe one guy's driving a Honda and the other one is driving a, a Lexus. Who, who gives a damn? You see what I'm, you guys see what I'm saying? This is why I tried to turn my comments off uh, and I couldn't find out how to do it. And, and actually when I found out something on how to do it, YouTube tried to force me into a situation where I would say my content is for kids, which you know what, you know what happened if I do that. Probably my channel will be shut down. I could not find anywhere on how to turn off comments. I have been to other YouTube uh, videos and I have seen the same. This is why I tell y'all about being gaslighted and nobody know what the hell is going on. And while I'm talking, here's a four, here's a 414. I don't even know if you caught that. I don't have time for this crap. There's a 414 at the gas station as, I, as I'm talking, 144. So I'm doing all this talking, guys, and somebody is asking me some question like that. This is why I want to turn off comments because this is not every. This is not my channel. Is not for everybody. It's not. It's only for a few people who who know I'm the real deal and that what I'm talking about and they and, and understand and overstand what I'm talking about. I, all the other Johnny come lately is not for them. They just gonna be asking you these asinine ass questions that's just gonna get me frustrated and off my and off my path. So I thought I'd just get uh, finish explaining for weeks about what's going on here in the United States, and then somebody asked me, "Well, what are you gonna do for work besides gig gaps?" I thought I just then explained 
why I do gig apps. How the what kind of question is that? So obviously this individual, does, I, I'm guessing this individual is not not only not from America, but don't know what the hell is going on. And even if they're not from America, this is still sound like they they really don't know what the hell is going on. Wasn't the government shutting down small businesses in other countries? 